Hey yo, it's Tadpole, and welcome to the first ever video on this channel. That's exciting. I don't really have a hang of this whole filming thing quite yet, uh, and I'm a little nervous because you can only open these guys up once. But I'm also very excited because I'm... I was a huge fan of Lilith's Pet Shop as a kid. Uh, and I'm getting back into it, because these guys are very cute, and I just keep watching the TV shows, even though I'm a little bit too old for that. Anyways, we should probably open these, uh, but before we do, let's go over the plan for today. Uh, basically, I'm going to open up both of these guys, and then once we see what we get, hopefully they're not duplicates, uh, we're going to customize them in sort of a speed paint, but also sort of like a vlog type thing. It's going to be fun, hopefully. Okay, let's open this one first, because... It was a little opened in the store, and I know almost nothing about Lilith's Pet Shops and, like, what series this is or if it's even a real one. I just got it from Walmart, and it, uh, it says that it comes with an accessory and stuff, and that there's ten to collect. So, hopefully, I only have two here, because I don't have a real job. <laughs> So I can't afford to get many of these, but I'm very excited to open these guys up. Okay, uh, I think that is everything I had to say before we open them. So let's hope that I don't do this wrong, because I want to make a good video. Okay, so here's the top and the bottom. It's all... A little bit of a crinkly plastic. Uh, these are not the newest series, but there is a good cardboard and it's shaped to look like a pop can. And you can see right here there's a little bird drinking some soda, I guess, for the Americans. Uh, and this is a little pull tab. So let's open it up. Ooh, is this a checklist? I love checklists. Let's see. Ooh, that looks cute already. Ten to collect. Uh, okay, so it looks like we have... I think that's a bear. I'm not the best at animal naming. That's a bird. That's definitely a bird. That one has honey, so I'm guessing it's a bear. That one's some sort of bug. That's a horse, and a dog, and a kitty, and a bunny, and another dog, and a lion. My star sign is Leo, so if we get the lion, we will probably make some sort of zodiac-themed LPS custom. I'm really hoping for this little horse right here. I love the little, I think it's a horse, I'm not quite sure, but I love the little whipped cream it has. Can you see that? Yep. Oh, that one's very cute too, I like that. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to say the animals better once I actually have them in my hand. Okay, let's see. Oh, I moved the box. Okay, let's see what's in this one. There's rip. Does not look like it. Okay. So. Oh, wait. There is a dotted line. Look more carefully at the packages, kids. Looks like we have a little orange juice accessory. Oh, an orange with a straw in it. And 
that is so cute. I just, <laughs> I love the little straw and the leaves. They kind of look like, like mint leaves. I'm sorry, I was a little far away. Okay. Ooh, look at the texturing on that. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I dropped it. Set that up there. Okay, next blind bed. Ooh. This feels like our actual Lois pet shop, so I'm going to put him down there. Yeah, okay. There's nothing else in this, as you can see. So I'll just put that off to the side. So I think I know who we have, just judging by this little accessory here. So let us see. Oh, oh, I was right. It's the little Rottweiler kind of dog. And he, oh, he's so cute. Look at his little accessory. His little clothes is like a cup, cup for the orange juice. So let's see if we can't get this hat on. Oh, there was a real dog hair on there. Okay. This is a little bit more pliable plastic, so it's all right to get on there. Okay, scratch what I said about this being easy to put on because I had to cut away to fiddle with this for a couple minutes and it would not go over, go over this little guy's ears. So that's okay for our purposes because we're going to customize him and take off this. Let's see. Yeah, that's easy enough to get off. So we just have this little dog that we can, oops, sorry, this little dog. He's very cute. But I am not a big fan of the accessories because they're quite hard to actually get on the pet. Okay, I think we're just going to put these right here. So you can see the accessories that came with the pet, but we're not going to use them. Okay, so that was, oh, it was the, the main dog. 4-153. Very catchy, if I do say so myself. Wait a second. We don't have that. Let's... Ah. It seems as though I have missed a surprise. Oh, it's a little tiny thing of orange juice with a little orange slice on there. Let's see if it will focus for us. There we go. I just got all my fingers in the shot, huh? It's very cute. I like it. Okay. Now we have the full set there. On to the next one. Really hoping for no duplicates. Because I love this little guy, but I would like a different base to customize off of. He's very cute. Okay, let's see. That was a nice noise. <laughs> okay, let's see. Tear strip. This one's being a bit stubborn. This tear strip does not work very well. The last two worked. There we go. Now we're into the bag. Let's see. Oh, our little accessory fell out. Let's look at that first then. Oops. <laughs> it is a little mug, little teal mug with a little handle. It doesn't have anything inside, so you could probably put about two drops of water in there. That's what I used to do when I was little. Yes, very cute. Okay, let's move this off to the side for now. Put the mug down. Then our head accessory is... Oh, oh dear, that is adorable. It is the little bear honey jars. It's so cute. 
and this part, I forgot to tell you, but this little part comes off, and so does the straw on that one. It comes off, but you can put it back in. It's very cute. You can use that as an accessory as well. Okay, we have someone different. That's nice. Oh. Okay, that one's not going to stand up for us so well. On to the next surprise. Oh, it's a little stuck to the bottom. There we go. Okay. Oh, and our checklist is in the bottom this time. Oh, it seems that they tell you. Okay. So let's open this guy up. Ah, whoops, <laughs> I bumped the camera. That hair strip was apparently hard for me to open. Not as hard as the last one though. Okay, let's see who we have. Oh, I was wrong, it's not a bear, it's a little bumblebee. That's adorable. And he has an accessory of uh, the same sort of mug as over there. Let me get rid of this plastic. He's so cute. Oh, let's get a better look at those wings. Here, take off that. Oh, so cute. Oh, he's got a little stinger. And all six legs and clear wings. I think I'm going to leave those. He is adorable. Look at that little fluff. Okay, so this is everything we got in our two, uh, I guess they're called blind bags, even though they're not bags. Our two surprise toys. Oh. <laughs> our little bumblebee with the honey hat. I absolutely love him and I cannot wait to customize him. And then our little orange juice Rottweiler. He is also very adorable. I'm so sorry for the shaky camera. I'm just holding it right now. And okay, so that is the two and let's get on to the customizing.